According to recent information from Hanwha Defense, the K9A2, South Korea's latest upgrade to its acclaimed 155mm tracked self-propelled howitzer, is expected to be operational by 2027. Building on the success of the K9 Thunder series, this latest model introduces advanced enhancements that significantly bolster its battlefield capabilities. At the heart of the K9A2's improvements is its new 155mm-52 caliber gun system, which promises a marked increase in both firepower and precision. The K9A2 boasts an impressive firing rate of 10 rounds per minute, thanks to its fully automatic ammunition handling system and automatic turret. This represents a substantial upgrade from the K9A1 6 to 8 rounds per minute, allowing for sustained, high-intensity fire missions. The redesign also reduces the crew requirement from 5 to 3, thereby enhancing operational efficiency and allowing personnel to focus on other critical tasks. Moreover, the K9A2's new gun system enables it to achieve extended firing ranges of up to 70 kilometers when utilizing advanced extended-range ammunition. This enhancement not only improves its offensive and defensive capabilities, but also offers superior targeting precision, making it a versatile choice for modern combat scenarios. In addition to firepower, the K9A2 features upgraded mobility enhancements, including an improved suspension and powertrain system. These enhancements ensure better handling on rugged terrains, allowing for rapid redeployment even in challenging environments. Such mobility is critical for maintaining tactical advantages on the battlefield. The K9A2 also prioritizes crew safety, incorporating additional armor to protect against mines and small arms fire. This focus on survivability, coupled with its enhanced firing capabilities, creates a robust and agile artillery platform that can operate effectively in a variety of combat situations. The K9 series has gained significant traction worldwide due to its reputation for reliability and versatility. Countries like Turkey have developed their own version, the T-155 Fertina, while India has produced the K9 Vajra T, tailored for local conditions. Poland has made a substantial order for hundreds of K9A1 and K9A2 units as part of its defense modernization efforts. Other nations, including Estonia, Norway, Finland, Australia, and Egypt, have also recognized the K9's advanced features and battlefield performance, further solidifying its global appeal. With its new 155mm-52 caliber system and fully automatic handling features, the K9A2 stands as one of the most capable and future-ready self-propelled howitzers available. By combining increased firepower, extended range, and enhanced mobility with the proven reliability of the K9 platform, South Korea is underscoring its commitment to advancing artillery technology. The K9A2 is not just an upgrade, it is a significant leap forward in modern artillery systems, making it a standout choice for armed forces worldwide.